Greetings, gigantic fans, and welcome to the Hero Overview for Zenobia, a tentacle temptress with a penchant for pain. Trained by Devedra in the art of sorcery, she wreaks destruction by controlling the battleground and debuffing her foes. If you are to achieve greatness, your enemies must be destroyed. It's as simple as that. <laughs> Gaze of Envy, Zenobia's basic attack. Attaches a beam to your target, draining their life force while restoring your own. This can be upgraded to Greedy Gaze to increase the health gain, providing you with more sustainability in the fight. Or Withering Gaze, applying weakness to your target, decreasing their damage to soften their strikes against you and your allies. Zenobia's Words of Spite lets loose a homing projectile that cracks armor, reducing defenses. It can be upgraded to Echo of Spite causing it to bounce to two additional targets, great for spreading out damage and punishing groups of enemies. While Demoralizing Cry adds to the effects, draining the target's movement speed and increasing yours to help close the gap or extend your distance. Zenobia's Wave of Sar, a ground-based projectile that knocks up and weakens, a potent tool for preventing damage and peeling for your party members. The Sorrow's Wake upgrade allows Wave of Sorrow to pass through enemies, excellent at disrupting the whole team and lowering their offensive power or Banishing Sorrow, to launch a foe into your combos or send them careening off a cliff for that tasty ring-out badge. Zenobia's Mark of Despair creates a targetable area that slows all enemies foolish enough to remain inside. Taking Depths of Despair will increase the area size and apply poison, reducing incoming healing to those affected, while Building Anguish instead delays the slow effect but builds to a burst of damage that denies buffs. Finally, Cursed Soul. Zenobia's focus skill. Disables those poor souls who are unfortunate enough to be caught within its area. Draining life but preventing them from taking outside damage. A potent tool for keeping targets out of a fight, like locking down a healer or preventing an entire team from assaulting a wound. In this clip, we see our pal Paco's in trouble. The enemy trip goes into stealth to chase the kill, but a well-placed mark of despair exposes her thanks to the curse on building anguish. Words of Spite with Demo Cry keeps her close as the team lays her out, putting us up 20 power for the first Rampage. Our Guardian is rampaging as we help secure a kill on the enemy Vodin. Heading to the wound, we try to get as much damage in as we can before Mozu starts shredding our HP. The opposing Paco wants to join the party and turn us into a purple popsicle, but we want to live, so we drop a Cursed Soul to disable them both. A quick Mark of Despair should slow them long enough to make an escape, Avoiding their attacks, we reach a much-needed healing bloom, get out alive to fight another day. And finally, we've got something extra spicy. Now this whole match, the enemy trip was trying to take out our Charnock, but this time we're ready for her. She goes into stealth and drops a Starburst to disrupt our buddies, but we spot her Glimmer. Knowing she's after Charnock, a well-placed Wave of Sorrow sends her off the edge, granting us a Ghost Hunter badge and the ring out. 